If you want a vaccine but don't technically qualify yet, we may have a clinic to try. The Ho-Chunk Nation offering vaccines to anyone over the age of 18 next week. You can get your first dose of the Moderna vaccine Wednesday at the House of Wellness in Baraboo. The clinic runs from 9 to 5. You don't have to live in Sauk County to go there. You don't need an appointment, although it is recommended you make one. The Ho-Chunk Nation asks you to bring your ID. We have a link to register at channel3000.com. Doctors have told us for months now the COVID vaccines are safe, but that doesn't mean you can't have a reaction to them. Perhaps you've experienced or heard stories about headaches, fatigue, or even a fever, but is one person more likely to have a reaction than another? Amanda Quintana found out today there's a good chance they do. I've heard the stories too. My sister had a bad reaction, my mom had a slight headache, and my grandma felt totally fine. So why do some people have a bad reaction and others don't? And does one vaccine make you more likely to have a bad reaction than others? Well, you can't answer those with just the anecdotes that you hear. You have to look at the clinical trial data. We look at these huge studies with tens of thousands of people. Dr. Jeff Pothoff says the numbers show younger people do have more side effects from the shot than older people, comparing your immune system when you're younger to elite special forces. As you age, the ability of your immune system to recognize and then quickly create antibodies and aggressively attack call it an intruder, starts to get not as good. CDC data shows in Johnson & Johnson's trials more than 60% of younger people saw side effects, with only 45% of older people seeing side effects. Similar numbers, but not as large of a difference in Pfizer and Moderna's studies. But the amount of reactions did go up with their second shot. Even within these you know, side effect percentages, um, when you take that down to the individual person, you just can't know what's going to happen when you get your vaccine. You might have some symptoms you might not. They might be mild. They might be a, a little more irritating for you. If you got the shot and felt no symptoms, don't worry. That doesn't mean your body didn't do what it was supposed to. Fear or anxiety can also create a reaction, releasing adrenaline some might confuse with the vaccine response. And data also shows more women getting a reaction than men. We don't know why, but it, it might make some sense because it seems like men do worse with COVID. So maybe there's something about being a man that makes your immune system not work quite as well uh, and maybe something about being a woman that makes it a little bit more aggressive which would explain why they tend to be able to fight it off better. Dr. Pothoff says most reactions are pretty mild. They can be treated with Tylenol or ibuprofen and they go away in just a couple of days. He says that's nothing compared to actually getting sick with COVID. Amanda Quintana, News 3 Now. If you've had COVID before your reaction, the vaccine could also be worse. That's because your body is a little bit quicker to fight something when you see it the second time around. That's also why many report more severe symptoms with the second shot.